From the 8 on your side team, your children's health. The American Academy of Pediatrics now recommends that children 10 and older who are considered obese be screened for diabetes. Tonight, medical reporter Susan Shapiro introduces us to two brothers and shows us the changes their family's making to prevent diabetes and other problems. Derek Rojas is like a lot of six-year-olds. He loves video games and some junk food. His mom, Maria Rojas, got concerned when her youngest son went to the doctor for a regular checkup. His blood pressure was high for his age, and I was, I was scared. I was very scared. That fear sent her to the Diabetes and Nutrition Center at Lancaster General Health. What did Derek have at home for breakfast yesterday? Registered dietitian Elizabeth Mamina Dinscher is helping the family improve their eating habits and lifestyle. Derek and his 10-year-old brother Paul are both considered obese in the 95th percentile. That puts them at risk for health problems, including diabetes. At school, choosing juice only with one meal, so either choosing juice with breakfast. Mamina Dinscher says healthy eating and physical activity can postpone diabetes in 58% of the population. It's a great preventative measure because once, once you have diabetes, you always have diabetes. There's no going back. There's no reversing. The family is eating more fruits and vegetables, drinking fewer sugary drinks, and controlling portion sizes. We changed the way that we eat. Maria is now reading more nutrition labels on food, watching especially for sodium and sugar. Mamina Dincher told her when it comes to cereal, she should find a brand that has three grams or more of fiber and four grams or less of sugar. The boys are limiting their screen time outside of schoolwork aiming for less than an hour a day. And they're getting more exercise. Mamita Dinscher recommends about an hour a day. Oh, come on. Paul says he's enjoying the lifestyle changes. Yeah. I think it's actually pretty fun because you get to try out new stuff. You, know, you get to have fun while doing it. That new stuff is paying off. During the recent weigh-in at the Diabetes and Nutrition yeah, Center, yeah, Paul was the same weight you know but grew look. three quarters of an inch, and Derek lost four pounds. Step away. There Susan Shapiro on your side, News 8. The dietitian says children between 10 and 19 who have diabetes tend to have very poor blood sugar control.